We're here with Kristen Baker, the creator, founder of Tello Films. How has the conference been for you so far? Collecticon is, I think, one of the highlights of my year. I, it's my second time at the conference. We were the first company to reach out to Collecticon for a sponsorship year one. Wow. Um, I knew this was going to be something special, and I think, I think it is, and I think it will just continue to be even more special and more fantastic. So I'm so excited to be here and be a part of it. Yeah. And, and support lesbian content and the fandom. Definitely. So can you tell us, tell our audience a little bit about Telefilms? Absolutely. So basically we're like the Netflix for lesbian content. We create original content. We distribute content. All of it has to have a lesbian character. Um, and we're just trying to become the place for people to go to when they want to see lesbian content. And all of our subscription dollars go back into either making more content um, or supporting filmmakers who make content for our community. Awesome. And the lesbian characters can't be killed off. That's correct. Yeah, so we have a couple rules if you want to distribute on Tello. Um, the lesbian characters can't be killed um, in the end. Um, if, it's a if it's a bisexual character, they have to end up with the girl and not the guy in the end. And there's at no point in the story where suddenly the woman realizes that she really should be with the guy or she's made a mistake or whatever and she ends up with the guy. So those are kind of the, the rules um, of, of our of, of of the series, yeah. The awesome. lead character has to be a lesbian. Very cool. So, Clexicon is definitely about representation and you guys are making that happen in the work you're doing. Is there a tip that you can give to someone who's gonna come to Clexicon next year? Oh my gosh, um, a tip. I would say, if it's your first time at Clexicon, um, just experience the vibe and recognize that everyone around you is an absolute advocate. Um, I would also say like the panels are so diverse and amazing. Find the ones that speak to you that will inspire you and go to them. Um, and, and we can kind of be shy sometimes, but I would say do what you can to meet people because this is your tribe. And these are the people who love the things that you love. And, and in that, we support one another and help um, support the people who, again, make the content. And then if you're inspired, you can also make your own. Awesome. So that being said, what is one tip for the audience at home that couldn't make it, the queer creatives at home? What's the one tip you'll give them for creating content out there? Content. Okay. So um, first, I would say you're if you have a smartphone, which most of us do, you have a camera, um, and just start shooting things. Just start thinking of like even like just start small and think of what would be uh, you know how could I get two people to do a scene together that I could shoot um, that's maybe uh, someone meeting someone for the first time or someone who has a crush on someone and the other person doesn't know like just think of these scenarios get your friends together and have them do scenes like there are actors in your area who want to work who want to make cool content and if you're passionate about that too like just go do it if you're a writer write just start writing and find that thing that you love um, I think a lot of times I, I, I've, I've heard that, that I think sometimes women have this like nervousness or I'm not good enough and, and our male counterparts don't always feel that way. They kind of just try it. And so I would say um, do something now. If it's just one thing that you can do, if it's writing the first line, if it's writing your idea down, if it's whatever it is, just think of one thing that you can do each day where your creative vision can happen. Or if that's supporting a fandom, right? If that's following someone on Twitter, following someone on Facebook, following someone on Instagram, just follow people, retweet things that you love. I mean, just find one thing every day that you can do that supports our representation of our community. Totally. Well, thank you so much. Yeah, thank mm -hmm. you. Happy con, you guys. Woo! Yay! <laughs>